prior to Turkish President G20 summit arrival, Germany announced its refusal to let Erdogan address the Turkish community living there. Following bilateral talks with the type Erdogan's German Chancellor, Angela Merkel stated their meetings revealed deep differences between the two nations. Ties between the two nations have recently soured due to several reasons. Among them, Germany's banning Turkish leaders from campaigning prior to referendum and Turkey refusing to let German officials visit their troops at a Turkish airbase. But not all meetings were tense. Turkish President Tayyip Erdogan also met with his Russian counterpart Vladimir Putin. The main topic of their meeting, Syria. Despite being on opposing sides of the Syrian conflict, Putin praised Erdogan for his efforts to bring peace to the region. Largely thanks to your position, Mr. President, we managed to dramatically improve the situation in Syria. A serious blow has been dealt to the terrorist groups in this period of time, and the regulation process has seriously moved forward. Erdogan met with several other leaders, including UN Secretary General, Mexican President, Italian Prime Minister and Japanese Prime Minister, and had brief talks with US President Donald Trump and British Prime Minister Theresa May. Speaking to the media at the end of the G20 summit, the Turkish president addressed key global issues like the refugee crisis and terrorism. In 2016, Turkey signed a refugee deal with the EU to alleviate the flow of migrants into Europe in return for financial support and visa-free travel for Turkish citizens within the Schengen zone. Erdogan called on EU leaders to hold up on their part of the deal. Our spending for refugees has reached $30 billion. No country around the world has been hosting refugees in such a manner. While we're doing all of this, of the 3 to 6 billion euros that the European Union has promised, we have so far only received 800 million euros. Erdogan also used his speech to reiterate Turkey's stance on national security, stating Ankara would not allow any terrorist group to settle along its borders and called for more cooperation in counter-terrorism efforts. Mikhail Bardavid, CGTN in southern Turkey.